Hey, how's it going? Halloween is here, and today I'm going to go over how to draw a ghost cat. Uh, it's going to be a cat in the style of a ghost, or a ghost in the style of a cat, one of those. So, this is going to be step-by-step -step for beginners, so grab a marker and a piece of paper. The paper I'm using is simple computer paper. Uh, as far as the marker goes, you can use whatever you want. I like this. This is a Faber-Castell P.I.T.T. Artist Pen Big Brush. I'm going to put the link to that in the description if you want to go buy that off Amazon. Otherwise, you can use whatever you want. Don't worry about it. Let's get going. Uh, first thing we do is I'm going to draw a line over here. We're going to start with the ear. Cat ears. Down. Pull around here. Kind of the flat part of the head. Up. Down. Down more. Down more. And I'm going to draw over here to the left. It's gonna look like Batman initially, but don't worry, it's not Batman. Down. Here. And I'm gonna draw some wiggliness underneath this. Ooh, wiggliness. And curve here. And then we're gonna do that ghost tail. I'm gonna have that wiggly line for the ghost tail. Gonna go over here to the other side. Gonna pull up. Down. Up here. And I'm gonna throw some jaggedy lines here. Here. down to that ghost tail. Then I'm going to go right here with the cat and I'm going to throw an upside down U shape and an upside down U shape over here. I'm going to throw an upside down triangle. A W shape for the undermouth there. Then I'm gonna draw. I'm gonna I'm gonna put down three dots on each side right here for more or less the pores of I guess on the cat's nose. And I'm gonna throw one line, two lines, three lines on one side, and I'm gonna do three on the other side too. Oops. And that is it. You have a ghost cat. Uh, I might actually draw right here, like a like a tongue. All right. So like, hey, ghost kitty. And I'm gonna draw a thicker line around the outline because I just think that should be thicker. Let me know what you think. If you do find my stuff worth following, definitely subscribe to the channel. I post a big influx around uh, September, October, and a bit of November, a little bit in December. But um, when you subscribe, it also subscribes you for the next year because I don't really post that much in January and February and all those months uh, till August. And uh, when it does, when I do start posting again, it will inform you. So it's completely free to do so to subscribe. And it's just kind of a cool thing for the future. Pulling up, down here. And just trying to make this line a little bit thicker around there everywhere. Alrighty, and that is it. Thank you so much. If you did enjoy that, click that like button. It helps the algorithm. Uh, and I reply to every single comment. So comment me. Happy 
holidays. Happy holidays. Happy Halloween. Talk to you later.